So they're very good tracking dogs, they're very good biting dogs, they're very good at searching, they're, they're athletic, they're, they can work for long periods of time. Operationally on the road we have approximately 60 general purpose police dogs and 14 detector dogs. Now 10 of those are drug detection and 4 of those are bomb detection basically. And their working life starts off as puppies when we breed them or purchase them. We breed most of our own dogs now, especially the German Shepherds. Um, and from zero to eight weeks of age, when they're with their mother basically, at eight weeks of age they, they then start their journey to become police dogs. At around 12 months of age, if the dogs are going the way we like, we start to uh, prepare them for a training course. And the, the training course starts when the dogs are around 16 to 18 months of age, and usually that that period between 12 months and 16 months, they're, they're bonding to a new handler, uh, the handler that will work them on the road. They go through a foster caring program and what we call a police dog development program. Um, if, so for the, for the most part, they're out in foster homes and we bring them back or we visit the foster home and check on the dog's wellbeing and the dog's progress. Uh, this is my fifth dog I've, I've fostered. Um, I obviously started uh, fostering pups with the intention of eventually getting into the dog squad one day so he uh, he's my fifth one and, and yeah uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. The, their core business in the end is tracking, tracking offenders and obviously if need be biting and subduing offenders so uh, to teach them to track they need food drive and ball drive basically so they've got to have a reason to want to track and, and get a reward and as puppies that's food but we wean them off the food at around six or seven months of age and then they start tracking for a toy. So we use those three drives for, for our training. I think the best, biggest buzz I get is when I get that after the training course and they're out in the road, I get that first text message from them to say they've caught their first baddie. That's a big buzz for me. And I tell my, my students on course, 24-7, um, you've, got to, you've got to text me with your first head. So I often get one at 4am in the morning a text going off and I'm going to one of the boys has got their first hand.